find me a major builder in the United States, any top 10 builder that doesn't have a build to rent division that has been created in the last 24 months. You will not find one. Lennar, KB Homes, pick one. They're all doing it because they realize that for the same reason that I just mentioned, those 10 million families were no longer going to be their customers simply because the gap was too big. They wouldn't qualify for a mortgage. So they're like, hmm, we don't wanna lose these 10 million customers. So we're gonna open a new division and we're gonna build these homes for rent and these 10 million families will still be our customers but now they're going to be renting in the facilities that we build and they realize that in the long run, they're gonna make more money because as a builder, you never get any tax benefits. You're building a home and you're selling it. The moment you do that, it's ordinary income, right? So you don't get that benefit. But if you take a build to rent community and you build and you put tenants in it, well, a year after the tenants go in, any money you make on that community is capital gains. Before we continue, let me take 60 seconds to tell you about Multifamily University. Are you ready to take your real estate investing to the next level? Look no further than Multifamily University. Our comprehensive resources, including guest podcast appearances, educational webinars, the Real Estate Trends Toolkit, and the Location Magic course are all designed to make smart investing easy and accessible. Plus, with no subscriptions, no upsells, you can trust that we're always looking out for your best interests. But don't take our word for it. Check out what our satisfied customer, Carlos M., had to say. Neil's presentation was filled with invaluable information that is not readily available to the average investor. This group takes you to the elite level of investing. Join the ranks of the elite with Multifamily University. Join us at multifamilyu.com and start investing from a place of knowledge today. Not only will you have access to a wealth of knowledge from industry experts, but you'll also be able to stay ahead of the game with our in-depth analysis of market trends and potential recessions or corrections. Invest with confidence and make informed decisions based on data, not gut feel. Don't miss out. Visit us at multifamilyu.com today or click the link in the description below. And now back to the content. So these, these billion dollar, $10 billion companies are wising up to the fact that that's actually a better market and there's nothing to prevent them from one day saying, oh my God, the single family market's hot again. Maybe in 2026 it's hot. You give notices to all of your tenants, you move them out and you sell those homes. So you still have the exit strategy of selling those homes if we have another explosive write up. But in the meantime, you're earning money and getting capital gains. Every builder in America is wising up to this. 10 million, uh, you know, families, it's a very large market and it didn't exist before COVID. It's so huge that if every single builder in the United States built BTR communities for five years, we wouldn't be able to satisfy the demand. And all of a sudden, abruptly, we, you know, a lot of them are stopped building because of what the Fed's doing. So we're just making the gap bigger.